What's going on guys, it's your boy JB. Welcome to week number 40 of the Chris Saint 100K Challenge. As you can see, it's Saturday, October 2nd. Hope everybody had a phenomenal green week. I'm actually glad that it's a red week because your boy went shopping. As you can see on the screen, I bought Charge Point twice. I averaged down. I bought 25 shares at 19.79, and then it kept dropping and I went ahead and bought 30 shares at 18.88. So let me know down below if you guys actually bought some more shares of anything, what place you guys got into. And that way, if it's still low uh, next week, I might tap into the same thing as you guys did. So uh, deposits. So deposits, I did not deposit any cash this week. And last week I was at 12,034.44. So we'll see where we're at here in a second. And with that being said, let's go ahead and dive into the app. All right guys, so we are inside the app. I'm sitting at 11,781 on the dot. Uh, buying power is at 29.8096 because as I just said, I just bought some charge point, which is why I went down. And let's go ahead and dive into my plays. So charge point for the week down a little bit above three percent. Total return about even. Market value at 1,062.05. The average cost of 19.29, which is great because I was. Was a plan on getting to this play unless it broke 20 and it finally did. Because as I look at the chart, 20, 20 right here, and 20 right here again. And then it finally broke through yesterday. So, but that was the reason why I was holding on as long as I possibly could. Uh, so it, it cracked that uh, support level. But next up, at point for the week down a little bit above six and a half percent market value at 1300 total return still down a little bit above 40 percent average cost of 1440 and i'm holding 155 shares of this amc for the week down a little bit above four and a half percent market value 765 total return down a little bit above four percent average cost 4003 holding 20 shares of this Future FinTech for the week down 2.82%. Market value 21, 21.75, down 43%. Average cost 363. Holding over a thousand shares of this. Workforce for the week down 1.32%. Market value is only 172.49, down 50% in this play. Average cost 15.12, holding 23 shares of this. Nike for the week down 1.36%, market value 442.47, down 1.72 total return and average cost 150.07, so I can still average down in this. Hopefully it turns red next week, that way I can buy more shares of this and only have three so far. Apple for the week down about 2%, market value 17.14.24, up about 3%. Average cost 138.46, and I'm only holding 12 shares of this. Now going into my dividend plays, Crestwood Equity did very, very well at 3.53% for the week. Market value 278.54, total returns 62.59%. Average cost 17.48, holding about 10 shares of this. IIPR, Innovative Industrial Properties, for the week down 5.55%, market value 709.46, total return still up 33.5%, average cost is 175.39, only three shares of that. So now I'm gonna dive into my completed transfers. So yeah guys, my completed transfers, my last one still September 20th, I may or may not put 500 next week, just depending on how that market goes. If it Turns red again next week. I will buy some more. Um, hopefully, either DraftKings if it dips at 44 or um, some more Nike, like I said earlier. So, um, if you made this far in the video, give your boy a thumbs up on the way out, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.